I'm the season of the move of God. If not, if you don't have the right people around you, as you, are, as you get ready to ascend Come into on. the mountain of God, My into God. the place of purpose, God of God, you know, you're going to have your assignment will become much harder because the people that are around you is not sensitive to what the whole life feel is coming, y'all. Come it's on. not sensitive to the next move of God. Is there are people here, and I believe that there is a move that's about to shift the economy of man soya. This cold mountain of church. I believe the prayer, Bishop Duncan, that we are at a place of an array of an immersion of something that is explosive. Something is about to blow in this room. Is there a people here who understands the time? Yes, sir, and the season has come. Oh, oh my God. I need you to write that down, but you don't come back to that. He said, time and season has fully come. My oh God. my God, yes sir. Woo. I feel the glory of God in the room. I want to bring your attention to the book of Isaiah chapter 60 and verse 1. I know I did not give that to you, but we're going to work that for a second. We're going to move in the veins of God. Amen. Glory to Jesus. Mm. 60 and verse 1. Isaiah chapter 60 and verse 1. Watch what he says. He says, Arise and shine, for your light has come. And the glory of the Lord is risen upon thee. Get up and shine. Get up and do something. That's right. Uh -huh. For the glory has come. Glory to God. When the glory comes, glory to God, it's come for a people that are making movements. Yes. Because God is not a monument, He's a movement. Is there anybody here? And whenever you get in something that seems to be a monument, it means that it's dead. It's just an image that does not move. But I believe that there is a movement that's about that's taking place now that is erupting the demonic systems of the earth. But God, that is now changing territories and dimensions in the earth realm. But there are people here, so I believe now that system of the earth, God, God, Bishop Delton, systems are now coming together because there is a vision, God, God, that the Lord would have placed in your heart, God, God, that now shift economies and dimensions. And there are people that believe this today. I heard the Lord say it. He said, I'm putting systems in place that will cause some things that have been planted to now be erupted because there is a new move and something is about the blow. Somebody says something is about the blow. About the blow. God. So watch me here. I got to move from this here. Yes. And so as we look at this statement arise, what this means is that there will be a responsibility on your own path. Uh -huh. And so we must understand that whenever it comes to the dealings of man or humanity in the kingdom of God, you know, it is not entirely up to God. No. No. And it's not entirely up to the man. But it will always take a, a participation. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> we are because God who's almighty, I guess what he can do without man. He has chosen by his wisdom to always what? Demand cooperation right. from man. Yes. And God said there has been a cooperation, Bishop Dalton. And because of this reason, God said, I can work with you. Oh, yes, sir. And some of you, God said, I'm ready to work with you, but you're not cooperating. My God. So because there is cooperation. But if you're about to see something that you've never seen before. You're about to hear something that you've never heard before. And I'm getting ready to go to it because today the Lord sent me here to declare to Montana Church, go to God, go to God, rest because the Lord is with us. The Lord is with us. Rest. We can find rest now. We've been fighting for a long time. We've been gunning the gun. But we got the warfare scene yeah. that they did not want to stop. They've been building, they've been climbing, going to God. And God sent me here to declare. But what is that the fair? That the season of rest has come. But I got not just the rest from the work because the work needs to continue. But I hear the Lord say the rest of all the unnecessary warfare that's been going on in Mount Taylor Church. I came to the prayer. Oh, what is that the fair? I wish I had a people here who got to celebrate God. But the time of the shifting of the 
He says, for anything to be made manifested in a person's life who's an obedient to God, and if we leave it all up to God, and we do not know, neither do we understand the role that we have to play right. in shining forth and in actualizing destiny, right. guess what? You'll end up being disappointed. Yes. And your expectation right. will end up being what? About it. Bishop, you can't allow your expectation to be about it now. Right. You didn't plot too long. Let me stay right here. I feel something pushing me. But oh God, Pastor Carol, you can't allow it to be about it. Your expectation is too high. So God, so you got to continue. But oh God, to work along with me. But oh God, we are in partnership together. But oh God, he said, what you need from the spirit realm, I will release it to you. And what I need from the earth realm, you will give it to me. When I put you in the earth, I give you dominion. And I can only do what you allow me to do. And so I hear the Lord says, whatever you will listen to me, Bishop, in the earth realm, I'll work with it. And I'll pour out of my spirit upon it. And empower it. So go forth with power and with might. And nothing will be able to hinder the next move. I have a church in here. 